21 Rules for a Good Life According to the Stoics Feel gratitude for all you have. Focus on what you can control. You could leave life right now. Let this determine what you do and say and think. Do not shy away from challenge. Do not let hate consume you. Do not focus on what you can't control. Whatever happens to you has been waiting to happen since the beginning of time. Don't be afraid to accept help. Don't let the opinions of others dictate how you live. Do things to make you happy, not to impress others. Don't judge other people. Keep a journal. Take a small step in the right direction every day. Learn from those who know more. Don't compare yourself to others. Complain less. Associate with people who are likely to improve you. Be patient. Meditate, relax, be present. Be kind to others. You never know what challenges they are facing. Try to see the good in everything. That was 21 rules for a good life according to the Stoics. I posted this on Instagram and it got incredible feedback. I got so many messages from people saying how it's improved their life. So hopefully these rules for the good life uh, based on Stoic principles will help you in your life. One of the rules was journaling. I highly recommend journaling as it helps you stay on track and have aim throughout your day. Like the Stoics recommended, you need aim, otherwise you wander around aimlessly. It also helps set you up for any adversity and challenges that you may have. And it also helps you hack away at the unessential, like Bruce Lee said. So I do recommend the Mulling Brothers Not A Journal. It is a journal that is created by me and my brothers and it's a simplified version of a journal. It gives you direction, so it takes away the struggle of writing. I know some people like to put off journaling, they think it's not for them, so this is a simplified version, and once you start writing, you understand the concept, and it really does help you. I use it to get my goals done throughout the day, give me direction throughout the day, and I have noticed 
it does take away the monster that you create in your head when you have all these things going up in your head of what you have to do throughout the week, the month, the year. Um, it seems insurmountable that you're never going to achieve these things. You're never going to be able to do these things because there's so much. But when you start writing them down um, in little check boxes in this journal, you start to see it's you do this goal, this goal, this goal. And it's just little things that you tick off and you create that progress that helps push you, create that motivation for the next step and keep you going throughout your day. Thank you for watching. If you want to support what I'm doing, please consider becoming a YouTube member, subscribing, heading over to my website, www.theeverydaystoic.com, where you can get the Stoic Amor Fate t-shirt, which is a reminder to love your fate. And head over to the Instagram at The Everyday Stoic, where you can join in on the Stoic community and see Stoic memes, Stoke reels, quotes, lessons. Thank you for watching.